I've experienced a superpower awakening again. I will pop up your life. Hey, Teko! Did you hear me? This time, it's very useful! Again? You never learn, do you, Mr. Esper? No! I'm serious this time! I can time travel! Oh? Huh? What? I'll tell you how. While concentrating, one push-up will take me to one year later. It means that the more push-ups I do, the further I can time travel. This is on a different level from my other superpowers. You're surprised, huh? That is actually a good one! <laughs> I know, right? But what are you gonna use it for? Well, good question, Teko. I want to be popular with women by going to the distant future. I don't really get it. You're a goddess and you don't get it? Men will go extinct soon. Huh? It has been trending in the scientific field. I suppose you know about the Y chromosome that only men have. Uh, it seems that the Y chromosome will deteriorate and eventually disappear. I see. You're talking about sex chromosomes. Babies receive one sex chromosome each from their mothers and fathers. If both of them are eggs, a female baby will be born. On the other hand, if one of them is Y, which is coming from a father, a male baby will burn. This is how the baby's gender will be decided. On top of that, if the Y chromosome disappears, all the babies will be female. That's why you are saying the male will go extinct soon, right? Correct! This theory was introduced 10 years ago. The Y chromosome that human beings have has kept getting smaller. A hundred million years ago, the Y chromosome was huge as it was composed of more than 1,400 genes. However, now it is composed of only dozens of genes. It seems that at the earliest, it will go extinct in 120,000 years. That's why men will be rare and therefore popular in the distant future. Mm. I think I know a manga with the similar settings. I know the theory, but it is actually controversial. Studies in US show that the size of the Y chromosome has been stable after the dramatic shrinking that happened once in an ancient era. The reason for that, studies in Denmark found that the Y chromosome has a braking system that protects itself from going to extinct. What? Let's say that this story is totally correct. With your superpower, you can only time travel one year per one push-ups, right? Yes. In other words, you have to do 120,000 push-ups to go to 120,000 years in the future, right? Holy moly! I don't care what you say! I'll do it whether it's 100,000 or 1 million! Oh god, he's going nuts! Look at me, Teko! I'll show you how serious I am! One, two, three, four! Huh. Let's see how far he can go. Ten minutes later. <sighs> oh, you are already dead. But... <sighs> I did 300 push-ups. <sighs> After 300 years. Oh, we actually time travel to 300 years from that moment thanks to your superpower. Yep. Has the number of men decreased a lot? Well, I guess it wouldn't change much just in 300 years. Wait, apparently it has actually been increasing. What? How come? I'm not 100% sure, but the sex selection could be the reason. India, China, and other countries have started adopting this method. What is sex preselection? Unfortunately, the culture of family's favorite male babies still exists throughout the world. Women undergo an abortion if they find out their baby is female. Just because they need a male baby to maintain their family line. As a result, it is said that 160 million women's lives have already been taken away. That is unforgivable. Yes, right? Um, so why don't you give it up? I don't think men will go extinct. No way! We never know what's gonna happen in the future! I have to make my dream come true! 1,000 years later. Yes! <sighs> Finally, we got to 1,000 years in the future! Teko! Oh, you are dying! How is it? <sighs> 
<sighs> Has the number of men decreased a lot this time? Wow! Yes, it has! Really? I'm surprising too! It seems that there is an epidemic of infectious disease that only men can catch. What do you mean? As a matter of fact, if you compare men and women, men are way weaker to any disease. It is not only because of sex hormones, but also the difference in metabolic systems. In general, women have a stronger immune system, so they are highly resistant to viruses. For example, men more easily get the flu, and it is more likely to get more severe. And at this time in the world, it seems that the virus that is infectious only to men has appeared. Therefore, even if you ignore the theory that men will go extinct, men will probably go extinct anyway due to this virus. For real? Alright then, I'll finish it up now! 5,000 years later. Holy crap! I've never expected that you would do 5,000 push-ups. I'm pretty impressed. I'll do anything for my dream. <laughs> and now what? How is it, Deco? Oh, they didn't go fully extinct, but the number of men has drastically decreased. Really? Wow, the gender radio is 1 to 1,000. There's only one man to 1,000 women. What? Yes! Finally, my dream will come true. My life surrounded by ladies all around is about to start. I'm sorry to you, but you shouldn't expect that kind of thing at this time of era. <laughs> if there is only one man to 1,000 women, they would all come after me for making babies, right? This is a distant future, do you remember? Thanks to the evolution of biotechnology, they can now make both male and female babies in test tubes. That's why they don't have sex as much as they used to back in your era. As a result, it seems that people are no longer interested in sexual matters. What the heck? Where is my utopia? This is just a dystopia. What did I do that many push-ups for? After that, he was taken back to his world by Teko's redoing brush. Thank you very much for watching this video. Hope you have enjoyed. Please subscribe my channel and give me a lots of likes. Good luck in your lives.